Eclipses are a sight to see, but not all of them are the same. There's two fundamental kinds of eclipses. One is a solar eclipse, and that is when the moon moves between the Earth and the sun and blocks the sun's light from hitting the Earth. The second kind is a lunar eclipse. That's when the moon itself slides behind the Earth and moves into the Earth's shadow, and therefore the light from the sun does not hit the moon's surface. Solar and lunar are the two main types of eclipses, but there are more specific types of sky shows. At certain times, how the orbits align, the moon might be a little bit bigger than the sun. That's when we have a total solar eclipse. And when the moon's just a little bit smaller than the sun, that's when, when we have an annular eclipse. You end up with that ring of fire um, around the moon as it completely, completely, as much as it can, covers up the face of the sun. They call it annular because it looks like annual rings on a tree. And so they get that ring of fire around the sun because the entire photosphere of the sun is not being covered up by the moon because it's at apogee or it's point that it's just a little further away than it is normally. Eclipses are a rare occurrence. Solar and lunar occur on average two to five times a year, while total and annular happen once every one to two years. What makes it special is in that certain location. A certain location really only gets a total eclipse about every three to 400 years. So when the eclipse hits its peak, make sure you're ready for this rare space phenomenon.